Right, so we've got second inform Falcao and inform Quadrado. Now, second inform Falcao. If you guys have been watching me for, for a little while, you guys will know that I made a video on the first inform Falcao. And I absolutely hated him. I hated him so much. He was so, so bad for me. I just couldn't believe, I just couldn't quite believe how bad he was for me, pretty much. We've also got this inform Quadrado. Now, at the moment, he's about 140k, but by the time you will have seen this video, the foot champs rewards will have come out. So I'd, I'd imagine he's under 100k now, and if he is, that looks like a really good price in my opinion. I don't know how he plays in game, but he looks like a really good price in my opinion for a right winger with 94 pace and 5 star skills and 84 rare. That looks like a really good price. But yeah, let's get into a game anyway. Hopefully this second inform fall is much better than first inform. And yeah, let's go. Alright, let's see what team this guy is. Okay, inform Perisic. Uh, second in I think that's second inform card here. I'm man of the match, Salah, who we all know is very, very good. Informs Jan Mario's squad building challenge, Di Rossi and Parola. It's not a bad team, to be honest. That's a pretty decent team. At least he's not a Premier League team. Let's go Quadrado. Over to Hesse. Come on. Over to Falcao. Falcao, can you finish it? You can, yes. Already better than his first inform was for me. Purely because he's just finished that chance. The, the first inform, whenever I had a chance with him, he just missed. No matter what. He missed and it was it was just so bad. I am so glad that second inform Falcao has just finished from it. That's it. Falcao over to Quadrado. Quadrado, what a finish. Weak foot. I did not expect him to finish that. Nice little low drumming shot with his weak foot past the keeper. Again, like I said, I, I am quite speechless just because I didn't expect him to finish that first time. He's only got freestyle weak foot, but he finished it, so happy it is. That's it, Hesse. That's it to Quadrado. Come on, Quadrado. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Look at him go. Let's go, Quadrado. Do a little dance. I love his celebration, man. That little dance is so cool. This finished it, though. Not bad to see. It looked like he was falling over as well. Let's go, Quadrado. Two goals already. Not bad at all. Let's go, Quadrado. That's it. Falcao's waiting on the edge of the box. That's beautiful, dribbling. That's a beautiful finish. That is a fantastic finish. That little bit of dribbling there from Falcao, is, well, that's impressed me. That, that is already, this second inform Falcao is already so much better than his first inform. So much better. Look at that little dribbling where he switched it from his left foot to his right foot. So quickly, just that little touch. That's so good. And this is a good finish as well. And this guy's going to quit. I've got a feeling he's going to quit. Is he quitting? There we go. There we go. Two goals for Falcao and Quadrado already in the first game. This Falcao feels so much better than his first inform. Alright, let's see what team this guy is. Okay, Serie A team with nine goal and inform Gomez. I think that's the first inform he card here, isn't it? Or it might be the second inform actually. I'm, I'm really not sure to be honest. Oh dear. Oh dear. What am I doing? Why? I'm not. I probably will include that in the clip. Tried to pass it out at the back. I don't know why I tried that. I don't know who did the poor pass for. It was Kadira. It did actually pass it to somewhere where I didn't aim it, but still, it's my own fault for trying to pass it out, to, out of defense. That's it, Quadrado. Please, let's go. That's a fantastic finish. Absolutely fantastic finish. Like, the way he just stopped the ball a little bit so the defender couldn't get a hold of it. Like, look at this. That little, that little tap just to the side to put it onto his right foot. It was very nice. Let's go. one all back into it. That's it, Falcao. Over to Kazawa. Can you finish it? No, because you're a left back. And I didn't expect you to finish that anyway. Come on, Falcao. Get in the box. Falcao, get in the box. That's it. I know you've got good heading in stats. Yes, let's go. I know you have good heading stats, Falcao. And that's just proven. Look at that. That is a fantastic header. That is a very hard header to score. The fact he's leaped like an absolute salmon and just headed it into the post. That's what I like to see. That's what I wanted. That's what I needed, actually. Let's go, Quadrado. Let's go. That's a good finish, Quadrado. That's a really good finish. You know what? That's the thing that surprised me the most about this Quadrado is how good he is at finishing. I, I've i used his non inform a lot, and that's probably the main thing that I had with him is that his finishing just wasn't good enough. Whereas his inform, I don't know what his finishing is in game, but it feels so much better finishing wise. Beautiful from Quadrado. Over to Falco. Falco, finish it. That's a good save, to be honest. Well, actually, we're straight at him, but let's try and sugarcoat it a little bit and just say it was a good save. That's a good ball from Kadira to Quadrado. Oh, man, that would have been so nice if you got on the end of that. Go on, Quadrado. Go on. That's it. Look at the strength from Quadrado. Danny Alves back to Quadrado. Can you finish it outside of the foot? And he just places it into the bottom corner. Do your little dance, Quadrado. You deserve to have a little dance. 
That was a really good finish. Look at this, just outside of the foot, just curves into the bottom corner. That's fantastic. Quadrado with a hat trick, actually. I didn't even realize. Wow, not bad. That's it over to Quadrado. Quadrado back to Falcao. Go on, Falcao, finish it. Ah, oh, man. I can't even remember what score it was. What score was it? Um, yeah, I can't remember what score it was. I will take the 4 1 win. There we go. I will take the 4 1 win. Right, so I just need to say right now this second informed Falcao is so much better than the first inform for me, anyway. I am sorry that that says four goals on the uh, four games. Sorry on his record. My connection has been having an absolute nightmare today, and I've had like three. I recorded a video before this, and I had a disconnect, and I've, I've had two disconnects in this video as well, which is just—it's not nice, but you know, it is, it is what it is. But yeah, two games, three goals, three assists. He was really, really good. He was so much better than his first inform, and yeah, like I said, I just really enjoyed using this one compared to the first inform. Now his pace, he's not—he doesn't feel as slow as as what you'd think he would be. He feels probably about the 80 pace mark. Doesn't feel 75 pace. Feels a bit quicker than that. He feels a bit, a bit more agile as well than uh, than his first inform definitely did. And 86 dribbling, yeah, his ball control and dribbling is absolutely fine. He can do LTRT dribbling. He's got some nice dribbling. And yeah, LTRT dribbling is absolutely fine. There is a moment in this video where he does like some really nice dribbling where he switches it quickly onto his. From his left foot onto his right foot and then finishes it. It was a really nice goal. 87 shot. Yeah, it feels a lot more clinical than what the first inform did. The first inform seemed to miss everything for me. But this 87 shot, it feels it just feels a lot better. It feels so much more clinical. 74 passing, absolutely fine. He got three assists as you can see there. I, I did a little bit of hold-up play with him and he, he was good at that. I don't know what his strength is in game, but... Yeah, he was absolutely fine. You can hold the play up if you really want to with him. 81 physical. Now, this is where I get to it. He wins a lot of headers off of goal kicks. And he also won a header for a, to score a goal. And it was a really nice jump. Re he jumped really high. I know he's got like... I think he's got 99 jumping and 99 heading accuracy with power header trait as well. So, yeah, he definitely shows in game. You can win headers with him off of goal kicks. And, yeah, he just feels... It feels a lot better in the air. The first inform didn't win anything in the air for me at all. Somebody said in the comments before... You know, use use him as a target, man. I was like, I was trying to use him. I was trying to cross it to him. He just wasn't winning headers. This inform Quadrado is probably the one that surprised me the most, though. His finishing is so good. His finishing is so, so much better than his non-inform. I'm not sure what his finishing is in game, but yeah, he's, he's got a really nice finish on him. Two games, five goals, two assists. Really, really good. So quick, obviously. I, it says 94 pairs. He feels 94 pairs. 80 shot. Yeah, he's actually a very clinical, as I keep saying. In his long shots seem alright as well. They, they tested the keeper anyway when I when I hit a long shot. 78 passing is probably obviously it's a low stat for a winger 78 passing, but I had no problems with his passing at all to be honest. 89 dribbling, silky smooth, silky smooth. To combine with them five star skills, it's very nice and he's very agile as well. 74 physical, he does feel pretty strong in game. He fe he seems to stay on his feet pretty well and so. Yeah, this Quadrado, like I said, he just really impressed me. Smash that thumbs up button, subscribe if you're new. Twitter's always down in the description. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.